Well, hello, Irene Smith here, and today we're back at what used to be the Lavender House. And Did you say Lavender? Well, yeah, I said Lavender, and, and oh. actually, in a way, it still is the Lavender House. It's just three stories tall now. It's just your Lavender House as opposed to yeah, theirs. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Take a look, see what I you think. I saw it. That's nice. And now I heard a rumor. Oh, little birdie told me that I have to decide something. Yes, I'm going to need like your to help. I'd like to do that. Now. So, let's go in the front mm. door. Yay! And once we're inside, mm. now you can see I've done the floors. We have to do the walls. Right, mm. and that's what I want your input. I think I want to see... Uh, yeah. Uh, green walls. Green? A light green. Light green. Solid Just, color, you mean? Yeah. Yes, that's it. Okay, so I guess that would be paint, right? Yeah. Paint. Paint, paint, paint. Where are you, paint? I don't know, but now that I made a decision, uh, what do I do now? Well, you wait until I buy the paint. Okay. And then, that's cyan, blue, cool green. What do you think? Well, that might, that'll look good. You like that? Yeah. Okay, we will buy that. Yay! And then I will show you the rest of the place. Ah. Now, you can see I put in the kitchen, I, I put a counter so that we can have... Yes, I've noticed. And you've seen this bathroom. Yes. It's done now. Ah, yes, it's yellow. It's all yellow, so sunny well. yellow. Mm. And I haven't decided... I, do you want the, you think I should do everything that green? Uh, yeah. Okay. Keep it simple that way. Okay. And then we can go up a flight. Yeah. And up here we have, um, well, there's going to be, there's one That's bedroom. That's one bedroom. I remember when this was two, when it was one big room. It was, but I split it up. Remember I said I was yes, thinking about did. splitting you did say it? that. So this is going to be another bedroom. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Don't be in such a hurry. This is also going to be a bedroom. I wasn't in such a hurry. Then... I wasn't in such a hurry. Don't forget, there's another floor here. Hmm. Go all the way. Now, wow. this... I kind of like this hummingbird wallpaper. What do you think? Yeah, me yeah. too. Yeah, so this is an office. But through this door is the master suite. Ah. Now, this is something that I was thinking of doing. Now, for, oh, first of all, we've got the closet. closet. And now? And, you know, it's funny. I did the opposite mm. colors on the wallpaper in there that I did in here. And yet it doesn't really look that different, does it? No, it does. Okay. So, but over here we've got this like a divider wall. Uh -huh. And the reason we do is this is going to be... The TV wall? No, not oh, quite. A hot dog? I love hot dogs. Oh, a hot tub. A okay. hot tub. What do you oh. think? That one or that I one? Like the, I like the second one. This one? Yeah. Matthew, okay. when did you start speaking? Just a second ago. Well, that's oh, okay. good. Yeah. Uh, anyway. Uh, so, this will be the hot tub. Good. Well, and then through here is a bathroom. The bathroom. Okay, well. Purple. That looks nice. It's purple because I figured for once I should use my favorite color. Yes. Now, uh, And the curtains are that color, too. I think it's time for me to disappear. Oh, but. Come. What do we always say? Well, we always say to like, subscribe, and share. Well, that's true, we do. But what else do we always say? Oh, yeah. Um, see Beverly Hills Cop, Back to Left, uh, not in theaters on Netflix. It's pretty good. It's not like the first film, but that, that's to be expected. That is true. That is true. But there's something else we have to say. Oh, yeah. Chocolate, chocolate for, for Mark. And chocolate, chocolate for, for Allie. Never forget right. our friends. Never, never forget, forget. Our friends. Matthew, are you okay? Never give up, never, never surrender. Oh, Matthew. 
No, Matthew. Oh, he's asleep. Did you he's do it this time, here. Matt? Did you just hit your nose? I think he did. Oh, poor yeah, Matt. He did. Oh. Oh, again? again? Good grief. Well, that was our visit from Matt and Mark. So we are going to, I won't make you watch every ins, every second of the whole thing. We are going to go back downstairs. Oh, this is the second floor. I'm forgetting where the stairs are. Okay, so down here we are going to paint everything green. Geez, if we're going to do that, I should probably redo that floor. Oh, we'll think about it. In the meantime, I am going to pause for the, vi the recording. I'm going to do the painting, and then we will decorate the living room, family room, whatever you want to call it down here. So, be right back. Hey folks, Allie here. And before we get too far into this video, I'd like to remind you to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, like this video, share it with your friends, and make comments. All those things help other people see this channel. Well, believe it or not, I have painted this entire area. It is all green. And I actually, I bought, first of all, I bought some bar stools to go with this counter over here. And then I redid the kitchen floor to match, to pick up the green in the walls. I added a television over here and a sofa. So now we need a coffee table. Tables. Nah, I think this one. But I, I do believe that I want to go a lighter wood. There we go. Now, there's a very narrow console table. I jumped. I jumped because I have a hot cup of tea, uh, tea, coffee, next to the computer's keyboard, and when I moved the mouse, I put my finger right up against that hot cup. I don't know, that's taller than the table. I mean, taller than the couch. I think I'm going to leave it there, but I may end up moving it when I, oh, gee, that's got, it's really sort of a desk. I'm not sure I like that. Let's get rid of that. I know what table I'm thinking of, I just don't see it. This is a coffee table, but I think, I don't know, do I like that? I think for now I'm just going to leave it. You've got a pool table, how about that? I never noticed that one before. 
Okay, so we've got a place to sit and eat. We've got a kitchen. Plenty of area to work. some reason it keeps changing back from, um, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of liking the way this looks. It keeps changing back from precise placement to snap to the grid. Now, we have to figure out what to do with those walls. I don't think we need this anymore. I really like the kitchen part. We could use a painting here, I think. I guess I should be buying a frame and then putting something in it. Kind of nice. Go with that one. Abstract. Unfortunately, I'm pretty sure we're not going to finish this today. There's too much left to do. Um, now, I don't know if you noticed. We still have to do this. We have to do this hallway. And then we have this room. And we have this room, and we have, well, we did this room. This is, I would imagine, a young person's room, maybe sisters, or, well, I, I kind of lean towards this being a girl's room. But we'll see about that. Oh, table lamps. My goodness, I never did the ceiling in this room. By the way, and, and I'm going to do this using the wallpaper method that I showed in my video that I did a few months ago. 
it's actually about six months ago, right around the time that the new uh, the House Flipper 2 came out is when I figured this out. And to be totally and completely honest, I don't remember whether I figured it out or I saw somebody do it. So I don't want to not give someone credit. But I think it's such a useful idea. And, and most importantly, let me go to that. The wallpaper that I've been using for this color thing, this one seems to be the least expensive wallpaper. Oops. Definitely don't want purple. We want white because we want to do the ceiling. I think a plain ceiling looks not so good. hate to admit it, but today I'm feeling kind of yawny. A little sleepy. Why? I have no idea. Not like I didn't sleep well last night, because I did. Although maybe it's the fact that somehow a few days ago, I hurt my finger. I slept on it funny. I did something to it. And I was in constant, fairly severe pain. Oh, I need to do it out here, too. Then all of a sudden, late this afternoon, it stopped. So maybe the fact that it doesn't hurt right now is what made me feel like I can probably go to sleep. I'm going to finish these ceilings. And I think what we need to do is um, <laughs> we're probably going to do at least one or two more episodes on this build. I'm not trying to stretch it out or anything, but I don't want to... I'm, I'm torn between doing most of it off camera and do, doing most of it on camera. And I'm not sure which way to go. So it would very much help if I got your opinion. If you're watching this and where did I put that? Oh my goodness. So strange. Ah, oh, there it is. And it's empty anyway. Anyhow, this is probably the largest house I've built so far, and if it seems like I'm, oh, more leaves, lovely. I uh, asked on their Discord server today uh, why this hasn't been fixed. And of course, as usual, I got no answer, but we'll see. Maybe they're just not aware that this is still happening because by some coincidence, they don't build in a place that it causes a problem. I have no idea. Hopefully, that's all it is and they'll fix it. 
because so many other things about House Flipper 2 are so much better than House Flipper 1. And I wouldn't even mind if that happened because, like, it used to happen in House Flipper 1 if you use the decorative grass and you put it right up against the wall of the house, it would clip through the house. But all you had to do was move it. Well, that's fine, except that as far as I can remember, in House Flipper 1, there were no instances where plants that weren't on your property and therefore not movable by you uh, were close enough to clip through the wall. We're going to finish this and then we'll finish downstairs. There might be a few more things we want to do down there. And then the second floor bedrooms and so on are going to be for Tuesday. And I, I am beginning to have a feeling that what's going to happen is we're going to have two more episodes after this. One for this floor, finishing all the rooms on this floor, and one for finishing everything up here. And I know I showed you the fact that this is now the master suite up here, that they have their own bathroom. And <clears throat> we have to finish, actually we could furnish this room. I love how the office came out. I really love how this came out. I'll tell you one thing I miss sometimes is the wall that, uh, the wall, the door that they added on to House Flipper One, the one that is for wardrobes, where it has it's a double door, and the uh, center of the door is glass. It would have been nice here. So what we still have to do here is we have to add the bedroom furniture, the bed and the wardrobes and the dressers and stuff. So I suppose we could finish that now. I know I'm waffling a lot.
shelf. I don't want a shelf. I want a bedside cabinet. No, there is one. There it is. Nice the nightstand. like there's other stuff that should go in here. Mm, I guess. There's a desk too. Oh, and there's a wardrobe. Okay. Although there's a wardrobe in there. I don't know. I'm going to have to think about this one. Okay. Well, this bedroom still seems really, really empty, and I'm not sure exactly what to do with it. So, for now, we're going to leave it like this. We're going to call it a day here. Now, before we quit, however, let me take us back downstairs all the way down. I think what we did here in the living room came out really well. We've got this back porch area. And I think that when we come back, we're going to focus on making sure that the Downstairs is finished, obviously. Because, again, this looks really, really empty. A couple more chairs, perhaps. Uh, we've got the TV, of course. We've got the kitchen. Anyway, when we've got everything, when we finish the first floor, we'll also move upstairs and worry about this hallway and or maybe no let's skip the second floor for now we will finish the downstairs and then come up here and finish the master suite I have to find some more stuff to put in here because this is a really really large bedroom and it seems empty. So suggestions would be very welcome between now and uh, Tuesday. Tell me what you think. I really appreciate it. And by the way, the reason we have a master suite like this is thanks to the suggestion from my friend Irene who said that this would make a really great mass. The whole third floor should be the master suite. Now, we do have, I know I'm bouncing around a lot, and I'm sorry for that. We do have the wardrobe in here, and the mirror, and we'll pretend we don't see those leaves. So, that's about it for this week. We are going to stop here. We're going to pick up, hopefully between now and Tuesday, when I publish the next episode in this video, I will have figured out or gotten suggestions from somebody that will help me decide what to do to keep this from looking like an empty room. I love the office 
but that seems a little empty too. Maybe some chairs, or I don't know. Again, suggestions, please. We have to finish the, and actually that's what we're gonna finish on Tuesday. We're gonna finish that. We're going to fill out this room because it also seems a bit empty. And once we've done that, we will move up to the third floor and finish that. Then next Thursday, which is a week from today, we will finish the bedrooms on the second floor. And after that, we'll make one more decorating pass and we will be done with this property. We'll see how we did as far as making a profit. So enjoy your weekend. Please come back on Tuesday. And also between now and Tuesday, I would so love it if you would uh, give me some suggestions for um, furnishing that master suite a little bit more and anything else to do with this build that you think of. Enjoy your weekend, as I said, and I will see you again Tuesday. So long.